That seems a little loose. Wonder how we'll fix it. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to tighten up both your Y-axis and your X-axis belts. We're gonna start with the Y here because it's simpler and easier to show on camera. So to begin with, I've over-exaggerated this loose belt just so you can get an idea. But as you can see, when I'm moving the bed, you see the belt flopping like that. That'll cause inaccuracies in your prints, which you don't want. So thankfully, fixing that is a relatively simple task. All we need is our little Allen wrench here. And we're gonna stick it into these two screw holes here. I'm just gonna gently loosen up this one and do the same for this one. And I'm just gonna gently pull this back. You'll notice now that the belt is a lot tighter. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to first tighten up this guy a little bit like so. Then I'm gonna come along and I'm gonna tighten up this guy. And now we'll double check the belt. Now you'll see when it's moving, there is almost no play. If it's still not tight enough, you can snug this guy down a little bit and then loosen this guy up and almost use the outer one as a form of pivot. You might have to loosen up the back guy a little bit extra. To be sure. That seems pretty good, so we can just retighten it, and that's good. So now you can see when the belt moves, it's not flopping. Now let's go jump over to the x-axis, and I'll show you guys how to do that. We're going to take our Allen key, and we're just going to loosen up the two bolts on the underside here. Loosen them up. Now we can slide that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to gently apply some force and I'm just going to gently snug the two bolts down. We don't want to do this ridiculously hard, but you know, snug is good, stripped is bad. And there you go. There's the x-axis belt running like it should. Hope that helps. See you guys later.